totally belongs to... Don't move. Buddy, if I had a nickel for every don't move... Hey, Pete. MJ? What are you doing here? Same as you. Working. At least... I was. Oh, I, uh, think this is yours. Yeah, thanks. So, Robbie's got you covering a break-in for the Bugle? Well... Robbie doesn't technically know I'm here. And it wasn't a break-in until a few minutes ago. Uh, uh-huh. Let me explain. Excuse me. Hi, Mary Jane Watson. I'm covering the Fisk estate sale. Hello. Craig said we'd do this tomorrow. I like to get a jump on things. Well, I don't. You'll have to come back tomorrow. Right. Okay. I'm sorry. Hey, Craig? No, sorry. It just... It looks like we're gonna have to run something else on the cover. I don't know, uh, maybe the expressionist piece? You know what? I think I can make today work. Are you sure? You're here, no moment like the present. Thank you. Craig? Never mind. We're good. Let's get started. Look around and familiarize yourself with the items. I'll be waiting by the Baku statue when you're ready to begin. Can do. Fisk cut Peter open like a pork sausage with this the first time they fought. Pete got away, collapsed in my yard half dead, and I had to steal my dad's car to drive him to the ER. The first of many Nurse MJ moments. Too many. Let me know. Sounds good. Starting with the prize, a one-of-a-kind Kake Monbaku. Oh, beautiful. It's a Mifune? Correct. Mr. Fisk has exceptional taste. Did you know him well before his arrest? In a professional context. I handled many of his sales. Let's move on, please. Now, this exquisite piece exemplifies the traditional Tarashikomi puddled ink effect. The two Neo are so imposing. I can see why Fisk liked this piece. Definitely his style. He loved the duality. Destruction screams, but creation toils in silence. Was there ever anything irregular in any of the sales you handled for him? No. No, of, of course not. Not that I was aware of. Notice the intricate gold inlay on this ceremonial tea set. It's just... A friend in the DA's office mentioned that Fisk used art sales to launder stolen goods. I'm... sure I wouldn't know anything about that. Oh, I know. I was just wondering, now that he's arrested, if you had ever noticed anything... strange. You know what? I'm actually running short of time. Why don't we grab the cover photo while we can? When I told my DA friend I was doing a piece on you, he mentioned your name was familiar. Just the photo, please. Stand right there. Are you sure there's nothing you'd like to say, maybe off the record, regarding Fisk's activities? I don't think your readers would have any interest in... Damn it. Wait here, please. Wait. I recognize that statue. I gotta get a photo. That shouldn't be here. Hello? Craig, I'll call you back. My dear, I think it's time for you to go. Oh, um, could I use the restroom real quick? Fine, follow me. Thank you. This... this is a really lovely space. It is. 
And this will be the last time you see it. The ladies is around the corner. Be quick. Of course. Be right back. Hello, Craig. Funny you should call. Because the reporter you sent is clearly not working the puff piece we agreed upon. No, she's here now. I've got to get into that back room. If that statue is what I think it is, this just turned into a huge story. What do you mean he had to reschedule? Quiet. If she's not your reporter, who is she, Craig? Who is in my auction house? Oh my god. No, I do not trust you to fix this. Well, the first thing I'm going to do is have Miss Investigative Journalist arrested. And the second thing I'm going to do is collect your head, Craig. Dang, she's pissed. It is most definitely a threat. Uh-huh. Sure, Craig. Right. I don't believe you. Uh-huh. Sure, Craig. Right. I don't believe you. Uh-huh. Sure, Craig. Right. He told me about this. Fisk used it to hide evidence. Why didn't the cops take it? I know this statue opens, but how? I wonder if there are any clues in here. Statue can move. Most common pose is latent power. Mouth closed, left arm down, Right palm facing forward. Hmm. mentioned two poses. Mouth closed, left arm down, right palm facing forward. That 
that's not right. Fits, but it's not the right one. Excuse me, sir. You you can't be not good. Where's the statue? In in, in, in there. Ba Wen Jin Zao Su Lai. I was on my way to the exit when I saw you. You're lucky to be alive. This is the guy I saved five minutes ago. Listen, whoever these masked guys are, they're after this file. But I'll never get it out of here while the place is swarming with them. Right. Okay. Um, you hide back there. I take out the bad guys. You make a break when it's clear. Sounds like a plan. Good to see you, Pete. Yeah, you too. Not exactly how I pictured us meeting again, though. Funny. It's exactly how I pictured it. Stop! No. antique. I think I know someone who could help track down where this came from. A job for later. I just talked to Craig. You are not the reporter he was sending. You don't even work for Heritage Arts. Never said I did. Hi, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. You... You will not write a word of what you saw For the here. record, what do you know about the file those masked men stole? That... I, I don't... What about the long history of stolen goods Fisk has laundered at this auction house? Your editor will be hearing from our attorney. Mix? <laughs> like the last six months never happened? Since when did Mix become Italian? No idea, but I'm still glad he makes these fries. Totally. Best in the city. So, how's the grind at the Bugle? Mm. Well... Yeah, well, I just got an all-caps text from Robbie about my so-called antics tonight. So it looks like I'll be meeting with a legal team. Again. Uh, as soon as he reads the article you're gonna write, guaranteed promotion. So, creepy mask guys. What's your take? Just another night in the city. What's your take? I feel like there's a bigger story there. Let's not make this all about business. How's, how's it going with you? Did, did you get that promotion? No, but we're on the cusp of something really big. You know Oscorp would hire you in a heartbeat, right? One phone call to hair. Sure, but Dr. Octavius' work will help millions. I'm, I'm right where I want to be, right where I should be. Almost sounds like it's more important than your other job. I've never heard you talk like that before. 
A lot can change in six months. Why did you ask me here, Pete? You know, just, uh, just dinner between friends. Friends? Is that what we are? Well, maybe we could be, you know, if, if, if that's what you wanted. <laughs> There's a lot of baggage here. Yeah, sure, but is that so bad? I mean, baggage can carry good things, too, like, uh, like money and uh, keys and raspberry lip balm. Do you remember why we broke up? This is a trick question, isn't it? Saved by the siren. Talk to you later. Go. Cool. Love seeing you two together again. You always were my favorites. We've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this and the demons. You know the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are going to tell their story with or without you, and they thrive on controversy. So what's your end? I don't have one. I just listen. Okay. Up in. She's good. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mayor Osborne, I'd just like to say a few words. Our city is so... so? I think this gang war may finally be over. Like, like over, over? Oh, I'm, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends? Well, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure it out together. Yeah. Um... Well, thanks, Jim. I couldn't have said it better myself, but I'll try. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. But, uh, instead of coffee, maybe we could have dinner instead. I, I could come over, uh, I'll cook. Or we could, you know, meet at a totally neutral location for a completely normal meal cooked by professionals. <laughs> for acts of extraordinary bravery. Above and beyond the call of duty, it is my privilege to present Officer Jefferson Davis with a Department Medal of Honor. Phone call, sir. Kind of in the middle of something here, Jim. Sounds urgent, sir. Fine. Congratulations, sir. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family, my wife, Rio, and my son, Miles. Without their support, I, I couldn't do what I do. Yes, I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help but you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass, I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer.
Miles, are you okay? What happened? So you know that address you gave me? I went there. MJ. I know, I know, but wait. What is this? Just listen. This is the address Pete found. Men are all carrying firearms. What is this place? That office. Might be something inside that connects this to Lee. Need to get back there. Huh? What was that? What dumbass can't put their shit away? Bet it was happy. Martin Lee's really paying the boss? Yeah. We built this war beast for me. He finances the boss's new venture. Win-win. Need to get into that office. Well, you better clean your flag off that sloppy boss. boss sees that, he'll be pissed. What are they building? Is this all for Lee? Grave dust. Careful. All their gas is going straight into grave dust. You tried any yet? Only samples. The boss is still perfecting the recipe. Man. Got a kick. I hear something. Easy does it. What kind of vehicle needs tires this big? Where is it? I swear I left it over here. Yo. Has anyone seen the 316 socket driver? Hey, when do we get a new resource song? What was that sound? I saw something. I'm gonna check it out. Hey, anyone pick up more beer after our last run? Grave dust is messing with my head. What is this? Some kind of military hardware? There's the office. A lot of men in the way, though. Why's the boss being so intense about putting GPS trackers on everything? Protecting trade secrets. Doesn't want any word on grave dust leaking out. It's awesome. Still, Bill's paranoid. Who asked you? Get back to work. We're gonna pick up some more supplies. Not till we cool. toss the endings. Boss wants them lost in a Jersey swamp by next week. Grave dust is pretty under the table, I guess. Yeah, under the table, the floor, and the first few layers of the Earth's crust, Those yeah. barrels seem important. Alchemax. <sighs> oh, 
what's in these? Boss, come on! We'll never notice! Tombstone. You're right, Rick. Uh, won't notice? Because uh, it won't be there. God damn it! I said I'll fix it! You got some stones, Rick. <laughs> Let's see if they break. Such a disappointment. And now I need a new welder. Blueprints. An APC. This is what they're building for Lee. But why does he need an armored vehicle? There might... Here we go. GPS trackers. What is Tombstone using these for? All right, boys. Time to move. Get the gear for my office. Time to go. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway, here. Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never going to let me live that one down, are you? Nope. The Great Dumpling Catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. So, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but, but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves Devil's Breath. Whatever that is. Yeah. I'll dig into it. So I was thinking... What if we teamed up? What, what, you want to be my sidekick? Like, a uh, spider girl? Spider woman. No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A partner. Oh. Not again. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh! Oscorp CFO! Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did... Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Where do you want me to, uh... Just... the couch is fine. <laughs> See you later? Yeah. MJ. Crap. Reach him! That place is crawling with guards! How are you trying to reach him? Very, very... Quietly. Gotta go, partner. 
Standish is somewhere in there. Gotta get past that guard. Time to see if these lores Pete gave me work. That gap in the fence looks promising. Just need to distract the guard. Out of the way, fella. What was that? Gotta move. Now. Gonna check on our house guest. Stay here. Copy. House guest. Must be Standish. He's here somewhere. Need to draw him away from the stairs. What the? What the? What's that? Demons are killing anyone related to Devil's Breath. Standish is in real danger. I should get a photo of this. Got it. Time to move. Guess it was nothing. Standish. I knew it. I've got to get to that tent. Distract him for long. How's it looking? Convoy gonna be ready? Five by five. Get that truck moving. Should have been uptown half an hour ago. Copy. We're rolling. Check to clear. Continuing. Go, go, go. Stay alert. I think we got company. <sighs> Made it. important safe houses if dr. Michaels is in one of these Standish might know which one there's Standish's tent can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him Osborne doesn't trust anyone else to secure it hope his ego doesn't bite him in the ass or us
Charles Standish? Holy crap! Charles, where is Dr. Morgan Michaels? Lee sent you. Didn't he? No. <laughs> okay. He wants to kill me? You tell him to do it. Do it himself. I'm not with the demons. I'm not with Sable. I'm a reporter. And I want to see Lee stopped. Just like you. Watson. I've read your byline. Sable won't listen to me. She has Michaels in the Bowery. They're moving him to a new safe house tomorrow at noon. But she's totally ignoring Grand Central. Grand Central? The demons were talking about it when they held me. They're going there to get... To get what, Charles? What do the demons need to get at Grand Central? <laughs> what the... Charles! Oh! What that the was hell? not a Sable guy. Definitely not a Sable guy. Something. Sorry, Charlie. Okay, time to Wait, go. No, he knows something. <laughs> hey, okay, another thing. Sorry, Charlie. <laughs> you knock a man out, destroy my background research, and the best you've got is sorry, Charlie. Is everything a joke to you? What? MJ, no, I, I screwed up. It, it was a tension breaker. Tension breaker, right. You know, this is exactly why we broke up. I thought we broke up so you could focus on your career. We broke up because you wouldn't stop treating me like a baby. Don't do this, MJ. Don't do that, MJ. Oh, that's too dangerous, MJ. I may not have super spider powers, but I'm not made out of glass. You snuck into the middle of an armed military. You know what? Can we not do this right now, please? Did you learn anything about Dr. Michaels? Fine. Michaels is in the Bowery somewhere. Sable's moving him tomorrow at noon. Awesome. Anything else? Was he saying something about Grand Central before I jumped in? He was... No. It was nothing. Listen, I gotta go, Peter. It's a filing deadline. Peter. That's how you know she's still mad. Peter. Nice work, Mr. Superhero. Man, I'm worked up. Gotta blow off some steam on patrol. Standish said the demons are looking for something at GCT. But what could they possibly need here? Should probably call Peter and let him know what I'm doing. Actually, scratch that. He'd probably just tell me to go home and chain myself to my laptop. I'll just check things out quick and let him know what I find.
our oceans and rivers cleaner than when man first walked the earth. Mr. Lee. This will be easier for everyone if you remain calm and do as I say. Police! Over here! Office. I would like to speak to Mayor Osborne. Who's calling? The man he is looking for. What do you want? I want you at Grand Central Terminal in 30 minutes. But by yourself. There will be more blood on your hands. Make sure he arrives on time. How? First, let him go. Can't let him see me. 
Jones. Get to cover. You still got that tablet? Yeah. Better work fast. Okay, I got this. Come on. Come on. Almost there. You did it. Good job. Now let's get you out of here. What about the devil's breath? I'll come back for it. No. We're partners, remember? Can we argue later? If we don't help those people, they could die. So could you. I can't let that happen. No. No, I got myself into this. I'm getting myself out. What do you mean you got yourself into this? I don't like this. There's too many of them. Then let's start taking them out. Quietly. They're still too close. That did it. Grab him. each other, Peter. What do you mean? I trust you. Yeah, when I'm sitting at home behind a laptop. Oh, come on. Can we please get back to saving the city here? Take him. Start the timer. Busy. I'll take care of the devil's breath. You know what you're doing? No. Oh, okay. Looks like the blue is connected to the battery, and yellow to a fan. The red one has a little exclamation mark. Okay. You'll want to detach the wires from the battery first. Trace the wires to the other end and unplug them from there. Okay. Unplug the wires from the battery. these people out of here. I could use a little spidey help. You ready? This is Mary Jane Watson. Please leave a detailed message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, hey, it's me. Let me know when you want to talk. Texting isn't talking? No, 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 
not that kind of over? No, please say no. Huh. Okay, okay. And not okay. What is there to figure out? Oh, you think? Are you okay? What's happening? The convict started a fire. We got the building staff out, but May and Miles are trapped inside. I'm trying to find a way into them, but the fire's spreading so fast. Stay where you are, MJ. I'll handle this. Damn it. Move it, Pete. Move! Rescue you too. Peter, don't be crazy. Wait for help. May! May! Here! We're over here! I got you. Hang on! Oh. Hey, May, you all right? Get to the window! <coughs> it's too far! Uh, hold on! May okay? Everyone is safe. MJ, if it weren't for you and Miles, I would have been... As dead as I would have been the last eight and a half thousand times you saved me. Pretty sure I still owe you a few. <laughs> That's smart. <laughs> hey. I'm sorry I screwed things up. It's just hard being the one who always gets saved, you know? Sometimes I want to do the saving. I'm sorry I made you feel like you couldn't. Still partners? Always. Huh? Hey, uh, so I didn't know if, uh, you wanted sparkling or 
or flat or spring or mountain spring. So I got one of each. Am I interrupting? No. Um, MJ, Ms. Watson, and I were just talking strategy. Strategy? That's right. The city is in danger. It needs our help. All of our help. All right, well, call the play, coach. Okay. Divide and conquer. Ms. Watson, we need an anti-serum for Devil's Breath. Oscorp's developing something, but there's no way they can keep it safe from Octavius and Lee. We need to find the cure and protect it. I'll chase down some leads. Miles, you need to be my eyes and ears at feast. Anything goes wrong, call me. We need to keep that place and the people there safe. All right, you got it. What are you gonna do? Gang of costume nut jobs is taking the city apart piece by piece. Time I return the favor. Hey, wait, um, how do I call you? I mean, do you have like a cell phone in your, in your po pockets or something? Ms. Watson can give you my number. Good luck, team. Do you have his number? Are you Spider-Man's girlfriend? That'd be so cool. <laughs> <sighs> Come on, Sherlock. Show me what you got in this water smorgasbord. Okay, MJ, I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay, Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the- Excuse me. The lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security sweep. I don't understand why we had to clear the entire floor. It's because... Si yeah, that elevator goes... There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Oh, every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. That should do it. Crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Oh, man. I can't breathe. Let me back up. Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. Off limits, ma'am. Need to go around. I know this is frustrating, but please remember, Sable is doing this for your safety. More like Osborne's safety. Please, everyone, please remain calm. Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. I like this thing. Turn him around. Hmm. Better check it out. Good boy. I'm sure safe elevator controls in the security room. 
Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sab- Wait! Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire him. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic... Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. What is this thing? Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Norman bids the fabulous Osborne boys. Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movie. I need to find the code for that keypad. Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? Work order for keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Norman could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's lap. Norman locked up Harry's room. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? This room smells like... rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad. For doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so tired. 
Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. Harry's mom planted this when he was born. Looks like Norman has made a point of caring for it now that she's gone. Emily's terminal diagnosis. I know Harry's mom was sick, but I had no idea it was genetic. Did Harry ever get tested? Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? This is kind of cute. Norman keeps all the campaign buttons from his races. There's one for school board. And he's left room. Norman's bathroom is bigger than my entire apartment. Now I feel sad. Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Why didn't you tell us you were sick? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney, like his mom. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Could really use a coffee. Might have something to control. Stand by. July 18. Bingo. Sue, gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Look, looks like Norman's tracking Dr. M huh. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath Lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Alpha team, stay alert. 
Oscorp building, but no Michaels or... Don't think I've chosen the right categories. Dr. Michaels went to this Oscorp building. Oscorp building, but no Michaels... Where do these three categories overlap? That must be the lab's location. Hmm, looks wrong. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michael's path. Sure could use a coffee. Nope, that's just a Sable patrol. Bet I'm looking for a heavily guarded Oscorp building that Dr. Michaels visits. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michael's path. Don't think I've chosen the right categories. Dr. Strom. There's no movement. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Commercial build. Wow. Oscorp's going all in on defense. Bravo. And this must be the good old Al Devil's Breath. Should check the patrol routes against Oscorp buildings. Nope. That's just a Sable patrol. Oscorp building. But no Michaels or Sable. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michael's path. No. I need to track my- Ben Adder is a dead end. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath. No. Norman's not crazy enough to keep the ant- A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath lab. Where do these three categories overlap? That must be the lab's location. Good ol' Alpha Team. Nope, that's just a Sable patrol. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. Dr. Michaels went to this Oscorp building, but the GR-27, that's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? Have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location and a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Sector clear. Continuing patrol. Stay alert. I think we got company.
have something, Control. Stand by. Got movement. Stand by. Movement, stand by. Watch your sixes. Need to clear that balcony. You're amazing. It's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You, you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks, partner. Speak to your head doctor. There's no doctors here. Well, who's running this place? Me, mostly. Oh, okay. Well, it's been a while, but I'll do my best. I'll need masks, uh, gloves, right. whatever you have to sterile. Thank you. You can thank me by not dying. Oh, my God. They say she could go at any moment. Where are you? 
you going? I need to find Otto. He has the anti serum. <laughs> Maybe you can't. Maybe Spider-Man needs help from his friend Peter. What? Peter helped build those arms, remember? If anyone can find a weakness, it's him. Go get him, Tiger. So? Hi. Mary Jane Watson, associate editor. Congrats. Thank you. I knew you could do it. <laughs> what about you? Find a job yet? Oh, no, but, uh... I'll be right with you, honey. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I was actually considering maybe a career change. Hmm? Yeah, I think I might want to become a chef. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, it's... You're a scientist. A good one. In the last project I worked on, I created a monster octopus that almost destroyed the city, so... Yeah. I mean, you do make a hell of a chicken curry. <laughs> I do. Still working on my dumplings, though. Going camping? Oh, uh, my uh, new place isn't gonna be ready for about a week, so I'm gonna be crashing with Miles for the next few nights. Oh. You know... You can always stay at my place. Only if you want to. No, I, I mean, I mean, I mean, yes. I mean, no, no. I don't. I not want to. But meaning, I, I, I do want to. But only if you do. I never stopped wanting to. Me neither. <laughs>